Hi, welcome to Standard Charter TV. I'm Tai Hui, I'm the Regional Head of Research for Southeast Asia. Today I'd like to share with you our views on competitive devaluation and how that is not a good idea to help exporters out of the current recession. As we've seen in recent past, the export data coming out from Asia has been truly horrific. If you look at the past three months, we've seen Asian exports falling by around 20 to 25 percent. And as a result of that, many have suggested currency devaluation or exchange rate devaluation as a way out to help exporters. However, if you consider all aspects of this suggestions, it's actually a high-risk strategy. First of all, we believe that the competitive devaluation is unlikely to help exporters because we're facing a demand failure coming from the States and Europe and not a price competitiveness issue. And secondly, the whole host of problems that will come with currency devaluation. Imported inflation, our food and energy will become more expensive in local currencies. Investors' confidence, for those who fear that their own currency will devalue, such as for example in Indonesia, in Vietnam, in Singapore, in Malaysia, they may choose to switch to hard currencies such as the dollar, euro or yen in anticipation of currency devaluation and that could cause significant instability to financial markets. And of course, for companies who have large amounts of foreign currency debt, significant devaluation in the exchange rate will also add to their burden. So in short, currency devaluation is not a way out to help exporters, partly it's not very effective. But also, it could invite a whole host of problems to be faced by, by the central banks and governments. Hence, we find it quite encouraging to hear that during the G20 meetings in London that the G20 communique actually ex explicitly mentioned that currency devaluation should be refrained by member countries. And we feel that rather than using currency depreciation, fiscal policy and interest rate policies are probably a better way out to support the current economic turmoil.